I rejected Jonathan's $5 million offer in 2015 Hamzat. The All Progressives Congress Deputy Governorship Candidate in Lagos State, Dr. Obey Fami Hamzat, has disclosed that he rejected $5 million alleged bribe from former President Goodluck Jonathan during the electioneering campaign in 2015. He made the disclosure at the launch of Sanwo Alu and Hamzat advocates held on Friday at Fidime Hall, Okooga, Abuligba, Lagos. The event had over 1,000 APC members and party chieftains who came him in from around Alamosho, Aged, Agbado IJ, and its environs. He said that in 2014, I contested with the current governor, Akin Wamiambode for the governorship ticket of the party and as we all know how it went, the then president good luck Jonathan offered me bribe of $5 million and I refused it. Some of you here are my witness, I mean some of you that were sent, are here to testify. I refused because I was thinking about the future and I don't want to spoil my name. Let us remain calm, our turn will come. Hamzat appealed to party faithful who are aggrieved to work for the interest of the party because their time will come. Our work as Nigerians is simple and our campaign will be very easy because P2P destroyed this country for 16 years. They spent N1.7 trillion on power for 16 years and they were unable to give the country just 2,950 megawatts. Hamzat, a former commissioner for works, Lagos State, added, in the last three years, I worked as a special advisor technical to the Minister for Works, Power and Housing, Babatun Fashala, we traveled round the 36 states by road, the opposition party has spoiled this country because since 1999 to 2015, federal government did not finish any road project except the Lagos Abiyakata Road. He posited that the present administration inherited 206 road projects that were incomplete, whereas the present administration has completed 84 in three years. He said that between 1999 to 2015, the country spent N1.7 trillion on power sector which is the budget of 11 states and imported 900 containers which were abandoned at the port for three years. He lauded the Aziwa Jubolat in Abu for his foresight saying, in 1999, when Aziwaju became governor, Lagos state was a pariah state, it could only generate N600 million monthly and the salary of civil servants was N1. 2 billion and they have to borrow to pay salaries but today the state is generating close to N35 billion monthly. He said some people worked to make this possible, adding that successive administrations in the state have worked to improve the state's internally generated revenue. According to him, our party, APC, will make Nigeria great, the party is making Lagos a better place and is poised to do more to make Lagos progress to the next level.